Welcome. So today we're talking about Ben Corson. He says he's not a Christian anymore. If you watch his videos, he's deteriorating as we speak. Why? Because when you use the stuff of the Lord, when you hate the Lord, when you just want to get something, when it's a scam, when you don't care about that, but I'm getting stuff. And then when that's taken away from you, you're not going to then talk about Christ and esteem Him and love Him when He's the God who's going to bring judgment on you. You're the one that used Him for His stuff to get what you want in a scam. You didn't care. You didn't love Him. But now you're talking about mythology and uh, Greek stuff and Christ is a great philosopher and all this silly stuff that He does because He can't even get out of bed. But when He does... He can't love the Lord. Why? Because it's, that's the God that's going to bring judgment on here in the land of the living. That's why his father just pines away in his house now. He's not even on YouTube because people comment and they have to be accountable. Ben Corson has had ample opportunity. Two years now, he has all these television stations, all these emails, all these phone numbers. He could have gone anywhere and explained what happened. But he's done nothing except pine away in his house. He got ran out of Medford because he's such a, a nothing. And it's embarrassing. But he can't now love the Lord that's going to hold him accountable. Because they that, that's their judgment is just starting. So that thing that keeps him in bed at night, that holds him down, is that fear and that dread of when the judgment comes on him out here and everybody. And they're called to give an account. They're examined. And so it's just a lesson to understand that you can watch it for your very eyes by watching his videos and talking about Greek theology Jesus of flaws, all this stupid stuff because he can't love the, the Lord that he used and didn't care about who's now going to bring judgment on him and his family and that church. So it's just a, another warning for us as Christians to stick with Christ because if you leave Christ or you use the things of Christ and, and you don't love him and care for him, well, then you're not going to stick with him as time goes by. He's going to hold people accountable for what they've done and and the Ben Corsons and the John Corsons and the Applegate Christian Fellowship of Calvary Chapel, they're going to be held to account out here in front of us all, and you're going to see the judgment of God. Anyway, just a quick message, just to keep reminding you about following the Lord and caring for folks. So anyway, thanks for watching. This was Mike Stinnett in the Office for Truth.